Hi, this is Baiju Vasudevan. Today I am here with another PSN and Excel Pass paper. Today we will be looking at October 2019 Pure Math 1 paper. This paper has 11 questions and total marks is 75. Question number 1. You are given a figure. Figure 1 shows a sector AOB of a circle with center O and radius R centimeter. The angle AOB is 1.25 radians. Given that the area of the sector AOB is 15 cm square, part A, find the exact value of R. And this question has two marks. In part B, find the exact length of the perimeter of the sector. Write your answer in simplest form. And this question has three marks. Here, the angle is given in radians, not degree. Sometimes you can see like instead of RAD, you might be given a little c up there. That means the measurement is in radians. Now the area of the sector is 15 centimeters square. There is a formula to find the area of the sector. Half r square theta. That's the formula. So the area of the sector is 15. Replace theta by this value. And make r as the subject. So we can find the r. So r square is... Bring the 2 here, 30 divided by theta, 30 divided by theta, which is 30 divided by 1.25. So, R will be square root of this value, it will be plus or minus, but since R is the radius, take only the positive value. So, the answer is 4.898. So, when you round it to... Two decimal place it will be 4.90 or 4.9 centimeter that's the radius you must have learned this area of the sector or length of the arc length formula in degree but in radian this is the formula half r square theta is the formula for area but you need to make sure your calculator is in radian mode usually you can see a small r in your calculated display if d that's degree you need to change degree to r first before you calculate uh, before you find r in part b they want you to find the re, uh, the perimeter of this sector perimeter means you need to add all the boundary length of all the boundary lines this radius we already got uh, this radius in part a which is 4.9 so radius plus radius, so the perimeter will be perimeter equals radius plus another radius, 2 times radius plus the length of arc, this arc AB. So the arc length formula when your theta is in radian is arc theta. That's the formula to find the arc length. Now plug in all the values here, you got the perimeter already. 2 times 4.9 plus r times theta. 4.9 times 1.25. Which is 15.9 centimeter. 15.9, not centimeter square because we are talking about perimeter here. So the perimeter is 15.9 centimeter and this question has 3 marks. 